Baseball is live and on the air on the show. Opening night here in this brand new season between the El Paso Chihuahuas and the Salt Lake Bees. Now at the plate, C.J. Abrams. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. To two balls and two strikes now. Not the warmest night you'll see around here, and even 50 degrees at game time. And this will miss down low in the dirt, so he's worked it full now at three and two. Wow, from 0 and 2 to 3 and 2, and that last pitch on 2 and 2 wasn't even close. He had this guy in the ropes, but now he let him right back into this at bat. Again, another foul ball. Locked in a good battle. Here comes another one. Hit on the ground out to short. Reined in. And the off-balance throw beats him at first, and that's a tough play. Striding forward now is the DH, Ravik Valera. From the windup, the 1-1 pitch. Kelly isn't really known as the kind of starter that goes deep into games. It's not that he isn't capable, I'm sure. He just hasn't been that guy that works deep into games with regularity. Matty V, I'm not sure it's this guy's fault, but I think it's more the fault of the metrics and the way we look at pitchers now trying to limit the number of pitches and the number of appearances they have with particular guys in the lineup. And there's out number two. So striding forward now, Taylor Trammell. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Into the windup, here comes the 2-2 pitch. Lifted the other way down the left field line. And no one will track it down. All even at two and two. Here it is. There's a fastball well off the plate for a ball. You can bet these hitters are taking note of what the guy on the hill is working with. A long at bat like this in the first inning can reveal a lot. Base hit, and that's their first of the new campaign. The third baseman. At the plate now, Jason Bossler. One and two now as that one's fouled off. From the belt, kicks and deals. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Off speed pitch in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. Well, this has been a good at bat. He's now worked to count full to three and two. It allows the runner on first to be on the move with two away. That's lifted the other way out to left. And this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases. The run comes across to score and they jump ahead one nothing. Stepping in now, Webster Rivas. Rivas. Changed things up on him and he got him to swing through it one and two now. Hey, I love that pitch right there. Better execution after jump. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. In now, Eric Salcedo. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. And a curveball here. Good pitch, but a better take, and it's to two and one now. Shin high fastball that time, ball three. Cam Williams waits on deck. Fastball too high, ball four. Now to the plate, Cam Williams, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. The one one home. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Center fielder on the run. He gets there and makes the play for the first out. So a runner at first with one man gone. And sizing up the situation to bat will be Joe Adele. Now the one and one pitch. Fooled as he swings through the curveball. Two down. 
Stepping in, number 74. This will be his first trip to the plate in this one. Now a throw over. The 1-1 one -one home. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to one and two now. Working for the punch out and the offering. Now a fastball, but that's easy to lay off, and it's back to even at two and two. Sent on the ground out to second. Scooped up, throw to second for the force out, and the side is retired. Standing in, Gordon Beckham. He'll get us started in the top of the second. A ball and two strikes now. Lays off the one two changeup, and he's worked it back to two and two. And the pitch. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. Digging in, Brad Zunica. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Brad Zunica. Popped him up. Bim Boom is under it. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Stepping in, Abraham Almonte. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Here's the one and one pitch. And here's a pitch inside, and that got him. So coming to the plate, Michael Geddes. Almonte is off first with two away. Throw over to the bag, and he'll dive back in safely. And here's a ball hit in the air. And no one will track it down. Payoff pitch one more time. Hit in the air down the left field line. Long run for the left fielder. He can't make the play as it hops over the wall. And that's a break for the defense as it's going to keep the runner from first from scoring. And now C.J. Abrams. Three and one to him now. Three and one, here it is. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. He's in at second safely as they also score a pair of runs on the play. The designated hitter, Bravik Valera. Into the box now, Bravik Valera. This one's down to third. Oh, and it sailed right over his head at first. And now this ball's going to wind up out of play. And that'll compound now, matters even further. Taylor Cabell. And a curveball's by him that time as he falls behind now one and two. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. The one two. He certainly has an open base down there, but you don't want your defender standing flat-footed for much longer. Three runs already home here. Goes down and gets it as this is bounced to short. Fielded cleanly, and the throw just does beat him at the bag, so the side is retired. Standing in, Brandon Marsh. And they've got some work to do early on. Down 4 nothing already. Lots of baseball left in this one as we're still early on. But you don't want to fall too far behind. They're already down by a bundle. And one of the things you want your leadoff guy to get on and set the table for the big boys to start driving in some runs. And another foul ball. The next 3-2. Swing and a ball line down in the left field corner. 
but this is foul near the seats. Neither guy given in. Here's the next one. Hey, have an A-B right here. I know it's frustrating the heck out of the pitcher. You keep fouling these pitches off, maybe one misses over the heart of the plate. And he finally wears him down here as he strikes him out after a nine pitch at bat. The third baseman. The one two. The bouncer to the left side. Reined in. And there's out number two. Ready now, Joey Curletta. Try to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Ready with the one one pitch. Two out, nobody on. Looked like he got fooled on the speed there. Two and two. Got him swinging as he runs the fastball by him to end the inning. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Jason Vossler, as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. Now the one and one pitch. Hey, after the double in his first at bat, looks like he's trying to pitch around this guy a little bit. Hot shot to third and handled for the first out. Riding in once again, Webster Rivas. Over one for him here in this one. Now the one and one pitch. Ball hit high to the right side, but this will get into the seats foul. Try to hold back, but he won't be able to as that's ruled a swing, and there are two away now. The batter number three. Now at the plate, Gordon Beckham, 0 for 1 here in the early going. Popped him up. Salcedo is there, and the side is retired. Late now is the designated hitter, Brendan Lund. He'll start things out against Jared Eikhoff as this inning gets underway. The 2 2. Pounded three has been a great job so far by the eight hole hitter. If he finds a way to get on base, this could spell for a huge inning. Hit down the third baseline, but this will get foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. Another payoff pitch. And good patience exercised as he works out the walk to lead off the home half of the third. Settling in now, Anthony Bembu. Now a move over to first, back in standing. Now the 2 1. Pulled toward right center field. Base hit, and they're into the hit column. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. The batter number seven. At the plate, Eric Salcedo. There's a fastball on the inner third taken for a strike. Still one and two as he fouls it away. Grounded to third. This could be two. He's got it. Beckham for one. On to first, and they get them both. Now with the play, Cam Williams. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. Men on third with two down. Grounded to short. Scooped up. And a close play at first, but he's called out, and the side is retired. Play. Brad Zunica. His last at bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. Yeah, Matt, he's got to make an adjustment right here. His swing definitely broke down, dropped his back shoulder, and thus the result was a terrible pop up foul. Two balls and a strike now. The 2 1 home. Taken, strike two. Two balls, two strikes, a crucial count for both pitcher and hitter. So, Dan, what was your approach on the mound in that count? Do you still pitch for the strikeout here? 
action pitch right here, 2 2. The last thing you want to do is to fall behind and count 3 2. The right field, number 15. Into the box, Abraham Almonte. And it's fouled away. The 1 2. Now a swing, and he pops him up. This is right out in front of the mound. Kelly will take it himself for the first out of the inning. Now Trying back. to pick things up where we left off, Michael, Michael Geddes. He scored a run after stroking a double in his first at bat. And he's got to build off that last AB. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches, you'll swing at the rosin bag. I love the fact that he was able to work a double in last at bat. Let's see if we get more of the same right here. The one two. Again, he sends it out of play. Nope. I'm trying to pick up that outside corner, but this misses, and it's back to even at two balls and two strikes. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. So the lineup flips over and digging in C.J. Abrams. He drove in two with a double in his last at bat. Well he got a good pitch to hit last time up. Looked for it up in the zone and didn't miss it. Those are the pitches you only get maybe once in A.B. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away and that ends the inning. Digging in, Joe Adele looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there, north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. Drops one down here, and he'll try to beat it out. And he'll beat the throw as he's got himself a bunt single. Standing in now, Brandon Marsh. Pitch out, nothing doing. This is line to left, but pretty much right at the left fielder as he takes it in for the second out. Now at the play, Jose Rojas. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. A 1 1. Misses for the second ball. A runner on first with two away. And it's two balls and two strikes now. Now here's a ball heading for the right field corner. This has the distance and it stays fair. Home run. So now to the plate, Joey Curletta. And he fouls this one off. Hit in the air to right field. Right fielder is on the run. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. Dylan Peters is out from the bullpen as he'll get his first work of the season here on opening night. Next will be the designated hitter, Bravik Valera. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. And this is low, ball two, two and one. Fouled away. The two, two. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And that's a base hit, so the pressure's on to open up the inning. Now back, left field. And now Taylor Trammell. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Sitting in a good spot right here. Two ball, one strike count is yet to see a fastball. Have to be sitting on one right here. A bouncer up the middle. Fielded cleanly. One there. Throw on to first. Won't be in time, so they just get the one there. The batter. 
Digging in, Jason Vossler, one for two with a double on the ledger so far. Now a throw over to first. Ready with the 1-1 pitch. Lifted the other way down the left field line. And they can't run it down. 4-2 our score here as we play inning number five. And a good take there. Close, but it's two and two. Fouled off. Down the first baseline. But a foul ball as it holds it two and two. From the belt, kicks and deals. And he tries to get him to reach for it, but it stays outside three and two. And he finally wins as this is swung on and missed for the second out. Now batting. Coming to the plate now, Webster Rivas. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. He likely had ball four that time, but couldn't hold back on the swing, so that moves the count to three and two now. Struck him out. Struck him out again, I should say. His third punch out of the game. Set now for the bottom of the fifth. Stepping up to the plate, Brendan Lund. He drew a base on balls his first time up. The 2 2 is laid off, and the count runs full. Looked to me like he tried to do way too much on that 2 2 pitch. You don't have to come into the zone on that count, but a pitch that far outside isn't going to tempt anyone to swing. And that's out number one. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Anthony Bamboon, one for one after a single this first time up. Now the one and one pitch. Lifted in the air to right field. Almonte is there, two down. Coming to the plate now, Eric Salcedo. Bases are empty here with two men out. Hit back up the middle. And the inning will continue as that's through for a two out hit. The right the right into the box now, Cam Williams. And it looked like the fastball got away from him there. And a full count now, three and two. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score all the way from first. And it's fouled away. Another full count offering on its way. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Gettys is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. So striding in, Gordon Beckham. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. A one-and-one one count. Here's the pitch. Line drive to left. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. He'll get it into second. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. The bat, the first base. Brad. To the plate now, Brad Zunica. Two and two. And he fouls this one off. Hard liner, but picked up on a hop. Throw on to first in time, one away. Ready for another shot now. Abraham Almonte. He got under one and popped out his last time up. Yeah, it didn't look good right there. Just out in front. You know, sometimes when a pitcher has great arm action, you're going to get that. You're trying so hard to catch up to the high velocity. If he shows that great arm action and pulls the string on you, sometimes a pop-up is going to be the result. And he misses low here, so the count goes to three and one. Inside as he nearly got him, and it's ball four. 
Into the box, Michael Geddes. And their runners at the corners now. Liner toward right center. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And they'll extend their lead even further as the runs in to score from third. It's five to two. Now back to the top of the lineup. Stepping in, C.J. Abrams. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. And with his speed, he's one of those rare guys who you'd actually like to see keep the ball on the ground. You can't beat out a fly ball in this game. Bravik Valera would be next. Heading out towards shallow right. Here comes the right fielder. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Stepping up now, Joe Adele. He's hoping to avoid the hat trick. He struck out in each of his first two plate appearances so far. Into the corner and slicing foul. The one two. Misses ball two. And here's a ball lifted high into foul ground down the right field line. And no one will track it down. Looking to send him packing again. Fly ball out to straightaway left. Trammell is right there as he puts it away. No problem for the first down. Digging in now, number 74. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Hit on the ground to short. He's got it. In time to first, and there are two away. Digging in once again, Brandon Marsh. Hit the ball pretty well in his last at-bat, but it resulted in a line-out. The 1-1 home is taken for ball two. Fouled away. 5-2 is our score here in inning number six. Lifted in the air toward the line in right. Long run for the right fielder. Into the corner. He makes the catch to end the inning. Now in the box, Bravik Valera. And he'll get us started in what's officially the back third of this one. at one in there one and two no offer at the curve that time and it's knotted up at two and two and the pitch he takes the change up the other way out toward right center Williams moves to his right and puts this one away in the alley for out number one digging in to try it again Taylor Trammell he reached on a fielder's choice previously 1-1 one, one home. And a swing and a miss here, so it's a quick two outs to start the seven. Ready once again, Jason Vossler. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, but it was a good change up, Matty. Good arm action. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. So digging in now, Jose Rojas. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. Going back to that last at bat, that's not an easy thing to do, to pull a breaking ball on the inside part of the plate and keep it fair for a home run. This guy's got some pretty good bat control. Skied into straightaway right. Almonte is there, and he has it for the out. Stepping into the box, Joey Curletta. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. 5-2 our score as we play inning number 7. Fouled off. Ball 2. Ball 2. 
And there's a base hit on the line. Jimmy Yacobonis is out from the bullpen as he'll get his first work of the season here on opening night. Stepping in now, Brendan Lund, and it's fouled away. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Into the box now, Anthony Bemboom. He flew out in his last at bat. Line, but speared on a hop. And that will conclude matters here in the seventh. Neil Ramirez is out from the bullpen as he'll get his first work of the season here on opening night. So stepping in, Webster Rivas. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. And he connects with it. This one's hit deep out to left center field. And that ball gets down out near the wall and should be extra bases. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. Now back. Second base. Jordan. Second. At the plate now, Gordon Beckham. Fastball close, but he didn't get it two and one. Hit hard down the right field line, but foul. Could take there to lay off the high fastball. Brad Zunica will be next. Comes with the fastball, but it's outside for ball four. Ready for another chance? Brad Zunica. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Zunica. One and one, here it comes. We're in the eighth inning now of a five to two ball game. The one two is a breaking ball that can't find the zone and it's even at two. Ground ball to second. This could be two. Scooped up. There's one. On to first and they get the double play. So a runner at third, two men are out, and that'll bring up Abraham Almonte to hit next. Almonte. To two and two now. And he fouls this one off. Another 2 2 offering. You know, all of the umpires in the seats thought that would strike three, and they weren't far off, but I think that was a good call. Looked to be just a bit outside. Hit to short. Reined in. Off-balance throw. Gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. Digging in and looking for more. Eric Salcedo. A hit in two tries so far. Two balls and a strike. Here it is. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. High and deep down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. Still two and two. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to go a little bit further outside the zone. Three foul balls in a row. He wants to get a swing and a miss on this next pitch. Pulled toward right center field. Center fielder coming on, but he won't get there. It falls in. The tag, and he's nabbed trying for two. Trey Wingener answers the call now, looking to get this one onto the ninth inning without any trouble. At the plate, Cam Williams. And he misses ball four. So he comes out of the bullpen and immediately walks the first man he faces. Better fielder. Joe Hit the other way out toward right field. 
Almonte is there to put it away and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. So here's the cleanup hitter, number 74. He was a ground out victim last time up. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And that one is gone on a two strike count with two away in the inning. Hey, in today's game of extreme velocity, if you have mediocre stuff, you cannot miss over the heart of the plate. You have to nibble at the corners. He wasn't able to do that, and he paid the ultimate price. Standing in now, Brandon Marsh lifted down the line and left. But this will land untouched. Two out, nobody on. And this will be fouled away. Sinker misses two and two. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Left fielder is on the move. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Now batting, Michael Geddes. He lined out in his last trip, so looking for better fortunes here. Yeah, Matty, but as he walks to the plate right here, he feels good building off that last A.B. He hit that ball on the screws. Change up, and that fades down and away, two and two. Protecting with two strikes, one out of the zone that time, but he stays alive. After fouling off the second one, I got to step out of the box, adjust my batting gloves, and tell myself there's no chance he's tripling up on that pitch. Another full count offering on its way. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Left fielder is on the move. He gets to it and makes the catch for the first out. So the batting order now turns back. over now and set to go. C.J. Abrams. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. Now the 2-1 pitch. Hit to first. And he'll step on first himself for the out. Digging in the switch hitter, Bravik Valera. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Adele is under it, and he makes the catch for out number three. Kyle Bearclaw comes out of the bullpen to shut things down here in the ninth. Striding in, Jose Rojas. And if you remember, I'm sure he does, he hit a round tripper back in the fourth. Swing and a looper to left. In comes the left fielder. Oh, and a great diving catch for the first down. Now at the plate, Joey Curletta. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. And it's two balls and two strikes now. High in the air out to center field. Gettys is there and quickly two are gone here and it's not looking good for the home nine. Stepping into the box, Brendan Lund, 0 for 2 for him to this point. Swing and a miss, he struck him out and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. And a nice job here to come in and slam the door. That's his first save of the season, but it certainly won't be his last. This evening's game comes to an end. 5-4, the final tally. The El Paso Chihuahuas jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Jared Eikhoff earns his first win of the season. Zach Kelly was only able to work four innings as he takes the loss. Kyle Bearclaw earns the save out of the bullpen, his first of the year. So that'll just about do it. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Pleszak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshownation.com.
And now our final line score. First for the victorious Chihuahua, five runs, eight hits, no errors. They left six men on base. For the Bees, four runs, seven hits, two errors. They left four runners on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 16 minutes. Thank you for joining.